Aloha fam, welcome back to day three here on Harmony of the Seas. We're gonna go visit the Bahamas in a little bit. Stay tuned. Family. Family. Love. Disney Wish just got here to the Bahamas, guys. Turn the boat around, getting ready to park. Promenade is looking pretty quiet. Everybody's getting ready for the Bahamas today. I'm about to go get ready too, guys. I gotta go put on my bathing suit and have some breakfast. It's crazy how different this place looks during the day compared to at night. Aloha, guys. It's time to break our fast. It's time for breakfast. Before we do that, we wanted to find some seats here. You gotta scout out these spots beforehand because they will get pretty packed pretty quick. And I don't know what's going on with my camera. Look at that. Weird. They're getting ready for their, their Bravo drill, it looks like. You got the fire brigade coming out. I'm gonna have to keep it light today, guys. I went pretty heavy yesterday. What a view for breakfast, guys. Same as usual, I got my bacon, my eggs, my hash browns, and a little bit of extra carbs. Nothing beats the wind jammer breakfast, guys. Almost station, busy as usual. Alright guys, so obviously we're going to explore Bahamas momentarily. We got Disney Wish blocking our view of the Bahamas. That's alright though, we like the Wish. However, before we get off the ship, there's a couple of things you might want to know because a lot of people don't really like the Bahamas. And the reason for that is because once you've been there once, you've kind of seen it all. There's not that many things to do unless you want to go and spend an arm and a leg and go to Atlantis or Margaritaville is always an option too now that they get that built as well. But I'm going to kind of run around the ship a little bit for about an hour or so, see what there is to do. Uh, if you guys are like me and you want to try and make the most out of these mornings while everyone else is starting to get off the ship and you kind of have a chance to do slides like this. Also, I'm not sure why, but one of the pools is closed. It's been closed a lot. Maybe it's just there are only one pool for port days, but interesting. One of my favorite spots on the ship because you can see the splash pad, you can see the coastal kitchen, the suites, you can see Central Park. 
We got another pool over there that is open. Pool that's not open. Awesome water slides, which I might have to go do in a second. More Central Park. More pool deck. And another pool. So many things, guys. And then, of course, behind the, the slides is the sports court, the flow riders, all the stuff you'd want to have fun with your kids back there doing, getting their energy out. I'd much rather be down there relaxing. Actually, that hot tub looks really nice. It's in the shade, no kids, and very empty. Guys, there are so many bars on this ship. It's insane. I think there's more bars than there are bathrooms. Just kidding. There's a lot of bathrooms, but there's also a lot of bars. I don't think they'll let me take my camera on the slides, but I'll see if I can sneak something on for you. One piece of advice I can give you guys is make sure you wander around the ship a lot. There's lots of nice breezy places here by the solarium. And this group over here, which I'll show you in a second, they found a really good spot right here. So I would definitely suggest trying to find the best spot that you enjoy because I like a little bit of shade, but I also like a little bit of breeze. So give me some sun, give me some shade, give me some breeze. I'm happy with all three. Some people just want sun, some people just want shade. My dad would be hiding in the shade. But explore guys, have fun. Solarium bar up here should be opening any second if it's not already open. Oh, look at that. It's already open and Obviously this cruise I do have my diamond drink vouchers, so that's always nice. I don't have to worry about a drink package this time Look how awesome this solarium is three levels on Harmony of the Seas. A Lord of the Seas actually only had two levels But there's that like a uh, peekaboo bridge type thing up there where you can uh, see off the corners of the ship I believe on some of the ships they actually turn those into rooms, and that's why they have the panoramic ocean view suites. I do not need a drink right now, I'm still good guys, but come visit our friends over at the Solarium Bar. Guys, they wouldn't let me bring it on, so I'm gonna drop off my phone right now and go ride. Hopefully it's worth it, I'll tell you my review after. slide with the swirl uh, I got stuck not the best water slide if you guys want a good water slide just do the ones where you won't get stuck the blue and yellow ones, which are up there I don't know if you guys can see them all right so my mom is inside right now picking up some grab-and-go food from Park Cafe and then we're gonna go and adventure the Bahamas a little bit it's not a bad idea if you guys uh, want to save a little money and not buy food out there go grab some sandwiches they are already pre-packaged anyway their Royal Caribbean sponsored tours. At least they've got it shaded this time. We've got a somewhat crowded cruise port today. We've got four cruises in here with us. we got the Disney Wish, we got the Carnival Sunshine, Carnival Liberty, as well as Harmony of the Seas. We are by far the biggest boat, of course. It's always fun. This way it looks pretty beautiful. The port is almost done, but there's still lots of work to be done on this side of the port. All right, we're making our way through the, uh, the vultures here. Just gotta get through this little spot here. Excuse me, sorry. Everybody's already heading back to the ship. I don't know. We just got here, guys. Let's go have some fun. No, thank you. Appreciate it.
bucks a person a day. And you get it for a few hours. market up here guys we'll walk through once or twice so you can see everything going on but there are always vultures in there so let's check it out can i show you my shop i'm gonna look at every shop we'll get some eventually we'll take a look at my shop we're just gonna walk through everywhere They're very vultury, but we're just trying to get business. Tropicana looks like a fun time if you're looking for a bar to go hang out at close to the ship. And then Senor Frogs, we got up here. Always a fun place to go and have some drinks. Good, how are you doing? Thank you so much. Found out that ferry boat's going to Atlantis. Probably a much quicker trip than taking the cab. What is that? All right, on our first stop on the Bahamas walking tour is going to be Junkanoo Beach. We already made it past Senior Frogs, as you guys can tell, and we got another half a mile to go, I'd say. See you there. I'm sorry, guys, I lied. The first stop on our walking tour is going to be Dunkin' Donuts. Just kidding. Glad to see they've got it here too, as well as McDonald's. All right, there's a good sign. We're almost to Junk a New Beach.
Wow, they let you have three people in and it's like a mini flow rider. It's not full strength. That's cool. And right behind their knockoff flow rider, they got a bar. 12 volt. Get energized. Well, now you guys know what you get if you uh, get the Margaritaville experience. I believe it's about $60, $70. I'm gonna have to come back here guys. Margaritaville is really cool. Lots of stuff to do. They got the floor riders, they've got the lazy river, they've got a jump that you can go off of that's like a 10 foot drop, so that's awesome. You gotta be careful stepping into the water, but it's pretty clear over here at least. Oh goodness, what are you doing here? It's so beautiful. The water is perfect temperature, guys. Come enjoy. It's so beautiful. We're gonna take a selfie, guys. Junkanoo Beach, always a good time. But I'm always biased because I come here all the time. Let's get a first timer's perspective. What do you think, Mama? How was Junkanoo Beach? Sometimes I go up to shenanigans because it's a good, nice uh, 
relaxing cold environment with pitchers of beer. You want to stop it? No, I'm good. I'd rather go back. I'm hot. shopping marketplace in front of the port right now because of all the construction, but they do have this little area. They all want to braid my hair. I don't know why. Make sure you guys keep your ship ID and your photo ID on you. That way you can get back to the cruise port without having to get stopped. Back to Harmony of the Seas we go. Hopefully Bahamas was enjoyable for all. I know we had a good time. Not exactly anything crazy without an excursion plan, but gotta make the most of it. And hopefully that little walking tour is something you guys at home will be able to do if you're interested. It was only about three, four miles total walking, so nothing too crazy. What's up guys? It's about 3 o'clock. There should be some live music starting around the ship soon. Maybe Central Park will have something. 
possibly the pool deck might have some of the Caribbean band. So I think I'm gonna go walk around try and find some live music because who doesn't like dancing and singing along, right? Much. Yep. Let's go head over to the pub on the Royal Promenade and get a strong bow. I'm craving a cider. So the promenade is pretty quiet right now, guys, except for two places, Sorrento's and the Boot and Bonnet Pub. You got your drinks on the right, pizza on the left. What do you guys think? What should we do? I think we're gonna go get the drinks. Give you a draft, yep. Thank you. I should have a diamond drink. Right? Yeah. Oh, you're the one. So you're not the one. Thank you, sir. Cheers, y'all. Nothing like a strong bow. actually two different ice skating shows on Harmony of the Seas. So the first couple days they do the 1887 and then they switch over to ice skate. So right now it's about 3.30 ice skate, uh, 1887 is going on, but I don't think we made the first show. So we'll try and go to the 5.30 showing and show you guys what that's all about. Of course the casino is closed right now because we're in the Port of Bahamas guy who apparently found a machine that's not closed. He's so excited he doesn't want someone to take his machine, even though he still won't be able to gamble in open waters for another couple hours. He's ready, really ready. So we hear the ice skating show going on in Studio B right now. I'll show you guys that in a couple hours, we're not quite there yet. One more place to check out the boardwalk. I don't think anything's gonna be going on back there, but maybe the carousel's going. Maybe we'll take a little ride on a horse. Looks like they're starting up the carousel right now, guys. Maybe we'll get lucky. ultimate abyss we'll get to it eventually but I did just hear a little story that it's a little bit slower right now they have a spray that they like to use in order to make it go faster and he said that when the employees use the spray they actually go all the way out and they land on the floor right there where he's putting the mats away how crazy but I asked him if he uses it and he says he goes on it every day and it's a fast fun time also the carousel is going right now I might take a ride what do you think only thing stopping me right now is this drink. 
Because I don't want to waste it and I don't want to chug it. It's delicious. So they actually stained all this wood right now, so they're only having us go out one exit and one entrance and don't touch the wood. <laughs> Alright, that was more fun than I thought of you guys. You guys gotta check out the carousel if you didn't already.
like the song as well. Oh my goodness. What a fun time. Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. It is formal night. We're about to go to Jamie's Italian. Got a reservation in about 15 minutes. We're almost time. Hello, how's it going? I got a tip. Yep, here at Jamie's. I got the chicken, my mom got the lamb chops, and we got the different types of fries. Truffle and posh fries. The rest of the food has come. Look how good it looks, everybody. Mmm. about it. Time for some pizza. Mahalo. Mm -hmm. 